guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to show you this um, Sarah Highland inspired look. I I thought she looked absolutely stunning at the Grammys. Um, I think Sunday or Monday. I'm not too sure when it was, but she was literally stunning. And the um, dress or two piece that she was wearing, it was breathtaking. And when I saw it, I was like, I have to do a look on this. So today I just did a Sarah Highland look for you guys. I really hope you guys enjoy this. I just kind of just put this together. I wanted to film and so here I am. I really hope you guys enjoy this look and let me know what looks you want to see. Just let me know in the comments below because I want to do things that you want to see and just to make you guys happy. But yes, yeah, so I hope you enjoy this look and I'll see you in the next video guys. Alright, hey guys, we're going to be priming our eyes because I did one eye, now we're just going to move on to the next eye, and we're also going to be putting tape on the edge of our eye just to make a more defined look. Then we're going to be going in with a gold color, and it's a big, blood, a big um, eyeshadow from Milani, and we're going to be putting that all over our um, lid. As you can see here, we're pressing it on, not swiping it, because I want it to be a very um, noticeable color. Then we're going to be going in with a matte uh, light brown and a darker brown, and we're going to be putting that all over our lid just to smoke everything out. We're going to be putting the, that darker brown on the outer portion of our, of our, of our <laughs> lid. Um, but yeah, as you can see here, I'm just taking it, blending it out, making sure it's very blended, because her look was very, very blended. All the colors just seemed to like go into each other and just blend really 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 nicely but yeah as you can see I'm putting that um, uh, darker brown on the outer portion and then just bringing it in with the brush just to smoke everything out and make it look very seamless and blended then we're going to be going in with a like light um, white color we're going to be putting that on our brow bone just to highlight that and then we're going to be doing that on the other eye as well just because I didn't on that eye then we're going to be blending it out once more. <laughs> then we're going to be taking the tape off and then again um, just to get rid of that um, brown on our um, face we're just going to be taking it away with the uh, beauty blender. Then we're going back into that um, gold color and putting that all over our lid again. Now we're going in with a white shimmer color and we're going to be putting that on our inner corner. Then we're going to be taking a um, a light, uh, what's it called a light eyeliner, putting that on our waterline, and then we're going to be taking a brown eyeliner and putting that on our upper. Um, we're going to be tight lining that. Then I'm going to be spraying some of like my setting spray on a on like the gold container thing, and to make it more pigmented, we are going to dip that into the color um, with the wet brush, and then that'll make it a lot more pigmented. Also, in her look, it looked like she didn't really have any eyeliner on, so that's why I put the, um, what's it called, the uh, brown eyeliner on, on the uh, tight line. Now we're just taking a mascara, and I'm just making my lashes super, super long. It didn't really look like she was wearing falsies, but of course she was, but I'm not going to be wearing falsies. We're just going in with L'Oreal Telescopic uh, right here, and then we're going to be going in with Georgiana Best Lash Extreme. Now Georgiana Best Length Extreme. <laughs> then we're going to be going in with um, foundation. This is the Revlon Color Stay, and we're going to be using a beauty blender to apply this. And we're just going to be putting this all over our face as per usual. Then we're going to be going in um, with a concealer, putting that on the highest, po well, the uh, places I want to be highlighted, under the eyes, down the bridge of my nose, my forehead. She did look very, very highlighted in this, in the um, pictures that I saw of her, and she also had a very like flawless look to her face. Not, it looked like she wasn't really wearing a lot of makeup. Now we're going to be cream contouring. We're going to be putting that dark uh, brown color on the um, places where you want to be contoured. And I will be doing a contour and highlight video with um, cream contouring. So if you guys want to see that, give this video a big thumbs up. 
Now we're just putting that on our forehead, um, cheekbones, and then we're just going to be blending everything out. Oh, and down the bridge of my nose to make my nose look a little bit more slimmer. The reason why I did this is because it gives a more natural look. That's why. And she looks like she had a very, very, very natural look in the pictures that I saw of her. So that's why I didn't really want to go heavy on the, cor uh, the contouring and highlighting of uh, my face. Because she didn't really look like she was wearing a lot of face makeup. And we're just blending everything out just so it looks all nice and put together. As you can see, it's just a very natural uh, look to the face. And I'm going to just blend everything out on the nose as well. Then we're going to be setting everything with my Anastasia Banana Powder. We're just taking a big fluffy brush and just setting the, con um, setting the highlight. And then we're going to be setting the um, powder... I mean, setting the contour with the um, two darker shades in the palette as well. And she didn't really look like she was wearing a pink blush, so then I went in with this, like, Avon, um, like, sun-kissed glow bronzer blush thing. And we just did this just to make us look a little bit more bronze, because she was very, very, very bronzy in her pictures that I saw. Then we're going to be taking a gold highlight, putting that on the highest points of our uh, cheeks. Then we're going to be going in with a lip color, and this is um, just a dark brown color. Putting that all over our lips. She had a very, very, very nude lip, like a Kylie Jenner lip, but not as like dark as hers. Then we're going to be going in with Color Your Smile Nude Gloss, putting that all over that lip. Then we're going to be going in with... Um, what's it called? With uh, brows, she has very like big brows, so I tried to mimic the same. They don't really look as good as I wanted them to, but what are you going to do? It's makeup. I could just wipe it off when I'm done. But yeah, she's very thick brows, so that's what I was trying to achieve here. And yeah, so now we're just going to be running um, that dark brown color and the light brown color on our lower lash line just to smoke everything out a little bit more. Then we're going to be um, putting mascara on their bottom lash line, and we are done. I hope you enjoyed this video, guys. I will see you in my next video. Please give this video a thumbs up, and please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I'll see you guys later. Bye.